Persona Q2 is coming to 3DS in a few days, and several people have gotten their copies early, thanks to Amazon. So just like with the first Persona Q, this localization does not increase the character limit on the naming screen. This leaves you with just six letters for each protagonist's first name, and six for their last name. So now with two more protagonists that you have to name, this can be quite frustrating, especially if you want to use what's considered to be their canon names. For instance, there's absolutely no way to fit Yu Narukami's full last name by normal means. Even by editing the save, there still wasn't enough space to permanently increase the length of his name. But thankfully, Death Chaos has made a very convenient patch that allows you to enter a much longer name for each protagonist. This modifies the code of the game directly to display these names instead of the ones that we enter on the naming screen. So no matter what you put here, he'll be called Yu Narukami in the event dialogue, menus, and battle. This is even better than editing the save anyway, because now you won't have to redo it every single time the game makes you name a character. So you can start the game with this mod installed without ever having to revisit this process again. So to get started, you will need either Citra, the 3DS emulator, or a 3DS with Luma custom firmware. If you want to know how to get that, check the link in the description for a detailed step-by-step -step guide. With Luma, we can just drop the modified code.bin and xheader.bin into the Luma slash titles slash title ID folder on our SD card. Just make sure that in Luma's settings you have game patching enabled. On Citra, you'll need a ROM that you can decrypt and extract. It could be a CIA, a CCI, or a 3DS file. I like to use .NET 3DS Toolkit to extract the ROM to a folder, which we can then place the modified files in and rebuild. Before we get to that part, let's talk about editing the names. When you get the patch from the GitHub releases page, you'll notice that there's a Canon names and a custom name 7-zip file up for download. The Canon names one uses the most recent official names for each character, as listed in the readme. I know Persona fans are picky about names, I still frequently see you guys argue over whether Joker is named Ren or Karusu, some people still prefer Minato over Makoto, heck, some people still call you Soji. And don't even get me started about her. So if you open the code.bin in a hex editor from the custom names download, you'll see that there's more than enough space to overwrite these names and fit your own. So if you press Ctrl F and start searching for one of them, like Ren, you'll end up finding this bit. And all you have to do is make sure that you don't accidentally alter the file size by backspacing or pasting in extra bytes, you just type over the existing ones. And with whatever is left after you're done typing, just fill it in with 00. zero. For each character, you'll have to put their first name in first, then their last, and then you do the first and last combined separated by space. Once that's done, I just overwrite the original files with the new ones. Rebuild my ROM, and just like that, it's ready to play if I just open it with Citra. Saves and DLC and stuff like that should naturally carry over using this method, so you don't have to worry about that. Well, thanks for watching. I hope this mod helps you guys. I know it really helped me because those six character names really irritate me. I really don't know why they couldn't increase that for us, but at least now we have a way around it.